I'm gonna make a video. Bet you didn't see that coming. I'd like to share with you my 10 secrets to making a song because everybody knows that I'm the world's best musician, obviously. Like, way better than Jimi Hendrix or any of that crap. I mean, <laughs> Purple Haze. Disclaimer, I do not own Purple Haze, thank God, because terrible. I mean, have you ever heard me play? I am so good. I'll stop bragging. I would love to share with you my 10 secrets to writing a song. So let's get started. Step one, the first thing you're going to need is a book. Now I've got here my top secret songbook. Look at this beauty. It's got it's got everything. New York Times bestseller. So many good reviews for it. Only eyes that have ever seen this book is mine. You should feel very lucky that you're seeing this, but I'm not going to share with you what's inside because... Top secret! So here's our blank page. Yeah! The second thing you are going to need is a, da -da -da -da, a pen or a pencil or a marker, a crayon. The third thing you're going to need, an instrument! Or if you're like one of those not talented people, that's okay too. All you have to do is clap. So now that you have all those things, fourth thing that you're gonna need, the source of creativity. Your source of creativity should be coming from the world's most amazing invention, which everyone knows is food. I'm too lazy to go make any food, but I've got um a good substitute. For copyright reasons, it's soda or cola or pop or whatever the heck you call it, you northerners. So now that you have your source of creativity, you're gonna need your actual creativity. Yeah, which means, you know, something to write about. What is going to inspire you to write a song? For example, I'm going to be doing falling in love with a boy. How original is that? So the sixth thing you're gonna need is the order of your song. First verse, chorus. A second verse, another chorus. A bridge, and oh wait, there's more! Another chorus! Let's go ahead and write our verse. You're gonna write whatever the heart desires. I loved you. If you put past tense, it means they did something that changed your mind. Crazy! I loved you so much. I you liked your hair and such, but you are a klutz. Now let's go ahead and write our chorus. Riding around town and I'm wearing a crown. This song just took a dramatic effect. Now, this chorus just shows that I don't love him anymore. He did something that makes me ride around town wearing a crown because I'm a queen, yo. So I'm leaving him behind. It's a breakup song. It was gonna be about falling in love, but you know what? I'm Taylor Swift now. What did he do that makes me want to break up with him? Maybe, let's say, he robbed a bank. So now that we have that, we're gonna need some groovy riffs and solos. Now pick your instrument of choice, which you should have done back at step three, ya goober. So let's go ahead and give this song some chords. C, C sharp minor, and then you gotta get some groovy riffs and solos. <laughs> Step eight is you throw it all together. Robbing banks just ain't my style. You gotta add some yaz in there too. Yeah! And then your groovy solos. And you gotta fade it out. Now, let's give this song a title. Princess of Crime. Because he was robbing banks and I'm a princess in this song. Unfortunately, this is really top secret information so we can never share this again with anyone else. So step nine is you're going to want to record this song. But you can go grab my whole album for $59.99. Go look it up on iTunes. It will be there sometime in four years, I think, is the set release date. And step ten. Now this is a very important step because after you've already put it on iTunes and everything, you need to take this song in here and you need to rip it out and throw it away. Unfortunately, I'm the best songwriter in the world. You writing a song is just not as good as me, obviously. And I just realized I just threw my own song away. That was a bestseller! Why do I do this? I've still got other good songs that my notebook is completely empty because I've thrown away masterpieces! I should stop taking my own advice, honestly. Anyways, I hope that you liked this video and I hope some things were important and learnable and find it in your heart to like this video. There's a stain on my shirt. Until next time, I will just be eating more food and having a grand old time. Have a good day. Bye!